the general term of the given series let's denote it by ur is equal to r times r factorial this can be written as r plus 1 minus 1 in brackets times r factorial which can be written as r plus 1 times r factorial minus r factorial this is equal to r plus 1 factorial minus r factorial Now putting r is equal to 1, we get the first term of the series, u1, is equal to 2 factorial minus 1 factorial. Putting r is equal to 2, we get u2 equal to 3 factorial minus 2 factorial. Similarly, put r is equal to 3, u3 is equal to 4 factorial minus 3 factorial. r is equal to 4 implies that u4 is equal to 5 factorial minus 4 factorial and so on. The n minus 1th term, un minus 1, is equal to n factorial minus n minus 1 factorial. And finally, the nth term is equal to n plus 1 factorial minus n factorial. Adding up all of these equations, on the left hand side, we have the sum of the n terms of the series. Let's denote it by sn. And on the right hand side, 2 factorial in the first row cancels with 2 factorial in the next row, 3 factorial in the second row cancels with 3 factorial in the next row, and so on and so forth, till we are left with only 2 terms on the right hand side, and therefore the value of the right hand side is equal to n plus 1 factorial minus 1 factorial, which is equal to n plus 1 factorial minus 1, which is the required answer.